guys. Hello, YouTube. I'm here with Giggly McGee. <laughs> See? Told you. <laughs> I don't know why every time him and I get behind the camera, I start to laugh. It's probably not because I'm funny. I guarantee you that. But, but anyway, <laughs> we're here for something exciting today. If you guys have been tuned into the channel for the last few weeks here, you know that we went out to Kentucky and uh, we checked out this really cool event called Fear Expo. Um, and we took you on the journey with us. And uh, for those of you who know, we did a contest during that time uh, where we were giving away a RIP ticket to Halfway to Halloween, which is an awesome prize because it comes included with some swag, uh, comes included with... Uh, so you get in to the the um the event the event yep. i think they're also giving you a swag uh, yep t-shirt lanyard also i think you get to do splat ball yeah jelly jelly, jelly, ball. jelly ball i knew jelly it was ball. something like yep. that yep and i think you get an entry into and the, the maze yeah th there's that's... gonna be a haunted maze i can't wait i'm yes. so excited if you didn't see our last two videos, you know what we were talking about. One, Fear, Fear Expo. If you guys didn't see it and you're just tuning in, you're brand new, check, check it out. that video out. Yes. Amazing. Yes. There's actually three videos to that. The other thing real quick, um, the last video we did kind of showed you a sneak pre... pre, 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 pre. It's called a preview. <laughs> preview. It's called a preview, guys. Preview of the maze. And it was so cool and i can't wait because they're going to have haunt actors in there from deranged haunt here in michigan very cool deranged haunt so um so that was a last minute development guys so not only are you getting a mobile escape room but you're also getting access to a really cool haunt maze that they're going to have set up and obviously they're going to have uh the art gallery harrowing hall as well so this is a really cool prize and we have May Six. One winner. One winner today, which we will tell you. Um, and for those of you who have just now joined our channel and you're new to us, just to give you a little bit of background on us. We are obviously two dorks, um, but more... Speak for yourself. <laughs> okay, maybe I'm the dork. <laughs> but more than that, um, we're home haunters, guys. That's, yeah. that's our big passion. Uh, we, we Every year we do a huge home haunt here. And uh, we also love everything that surrounds Halloween. So we check out other home haunts and we check out haunts and, and conventions, vendor trade shows, craft shows. So we're, we try to get out and bring all of our adventures to you. So if you haven't been here before, go check out some of our other content. There's a lot of cool stuff here. But today we are going to be showing you who won the contest. And then we also, also going to yep. one of my favorite things to do and show is a haul. So when I say a haul, that means we bought some goodies at the Fair Expo and we definitely wanted to show you what we picked up. Yes. Now, why did I come out of Fear Expo with something not Halloween related? Only I would do that. But you have to stay tuned to see what it is and how stinking adorable it is. There's also some other really cool Halloween items that is in this haul. So yeah. you want to stay tuned. Maybe not so cute. You want to, of course, whoever entered in the last video um, for the RIP ticket, you want to... Obviously, follow along and see if you are the lucky winner. So, we're going to get into this. Enough talk. We're going to get into it. So, stay tuned. <laughs> So, this is going to be a surprise for us, too, because we obviously it's forgot been, what we got. Yeah, it's been a little bit since we got it. So What's in the mystery bag? This is... It's broken. Oh! Oh, 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 okay. So, if any of you watched the video... Damn, what is that thing? That, was, that was the video two. The video two, right? 
Yes, yeah, so it was. Yeah, it, it was. was it was video. It was uh, Fear Sorry Expo the Part crinkling. Two. Yeah. So sorry. Yeah. So I. She's crinkling. True story. So I bought the scrub. If you guys watched that and watched the reaction to my face, this stuff was was amazing. And I, the guy said that I should be able to get super glue and glue and stuff like that off my hands. Well, guess what I did today? Yep, got super glue on my hands. So I'm going to give it a try. And we'll let and you know. And this was... What's that say? Damn. Damn good tattoo scrub. Thank you. Damn good tattoo scrub. So, of course, the guy, he was such a good salesman. Oh, yeah. Watch and, watch the video. You'll see. He was a fast talker. Yeah. Kind of reminded me of those old school Western, you know, medicine doctors that pulled into town, you know, and sold these miracle cures. And then someone gave us the, the koozie. Yeah, the koozie. And this was for Imagination's Halloween Superstore. That actually was really cool. That was the one girl who's selling the pig head, and she's trying to find a home for it. So if you go back to the video, you can see they had some really cool stuff. They were kind of like what they say, Halloween Superstore. They had masks. They had they had a, a special effects, contacts, everything you could think of. So. Um, I think that was given to you as a... No. Um, hey, guess what? These... These guys came from our good buddy, Cobwebs and Candlesticks. Oh! Yeah, that was, how cool is that? He makes right. these things. He's, I mean, this guy does gave, awesome so stuff. So he gave me like a whole bunch of stuff, but I was so excited about um, talking with him because he, I just love him. He's like a maniac, but a good maniac. Like, I love a little bit of craziness and he brings me that so I love his channel and you can't find a nicer guy such a cool guy we had such a blast nice. talking to him very and nice genuine. so he gave me a bunch of little magnets magnets so he gave me um his stickers as well very cool is that Frankenstein yeah, these are I so cool them. he literally makes these guys he literally makes these these are super cool yes yep yeah. so so I this is cool because this was like a surprise for me because like I said I put everything in the bag and then we were waiting for the haul and I mean just did you hold them up close yeah I held them? each one okay. of them yeah I think yeah we saw them all. so I got those from him yep which was so awesome pleasant so surprise. thank you so much cobwebs and candlesticks well, Mr. Keith, Keith Yep. If, if you, you know, watch this video, thank you. Yes. I appreciate it. I really appreciate it. We both it. do appreciate it. So, like I said, the guy was such a good thing. She bought more. I bought two of the big ones, one of the small ones. Yep, he got me. If you watch the video, he actually is sitting there talking and going a mile a minute. And all of a sudden, he looks at me and he goes, watch this. And when he said, watch this, Jamie pulled out her credit card. That's <laughs> how good he was. It makes... You're, you can use it for your feet, your hands, whatever, but it's a scrub and it smells nice, you know? And who doesn't like to smell good, have your hands feel silky soft? Just because we know? deal with horror doesn't mean we right. don't want to be clean. You exactly. Know? So. Okay, so now that I showed that, but I want to show what I got that was so... The piece of resistance. <laughs> this comes from Halloween Life. Yes. Miss Katrina yes. and Rob. Thanks. You guys... <laughs> This honestly, Jamie, this is one of the this is one of the civilian this is one of the civilian picks. Jamie right. was not bold enough to get stuff that had, you know, insects have, and body they, parts on they it. They had very cool stuff yes, for Halloween. Very cool. I just gotta tell you, for me, we have so much Halloween outside. She's throwing and, up. And I do Halloween on the inside, but the bugs and the stuff I mm, uh, I will tell you this. If, but if, it looks so real. If you are doing a haunt, yes. If you, pro or home, and you have any kind of a scene with a diner or a table, yes. um, that stuff will complete. I'm, I yes. promise you, it will complete you. Their stuff looks so or cool. Even if you just like to decorate your home, like I do inside. For, especially for Halloween and kind of gross people out. Or you're having a Halloween party. Yes, like, definitely Halloween for parties. For sure. Yes. Have a whole table yeah. or something. Yep. But I just want to show you how cool. realistic it looks. 
I've tried I mean, to eat it a couple of times. So, so cool. So that was from Halloween Life. And they do some great stuff. Guys, go check them out. Yeah. Uh, they, they, and, and the cool thing is all the stuff they do is black light reactive. It's UV reactive. So mm -hmm. it looks really cool when you have stuff set up. So take all it right. away. Next thing we got were these shoulder buddies. Shoulder Pe buddies. People were wa walking around the whole... Um, convention. Yes, convention. Thank you. With these on. And we grabbed a couple. We thought these would be really fun for our queue line. Yep. like Or even the person that's letting them in. Or taking donations. And things like that <laughs> yep. to have something like that sitting on. So the hand was perfect. Yep. This though, this one is fitting. He's slumping. Sorry. Here, hold the hold the yeah. hold the hand. <laughs> this one is so awesome and it He's fits us. with our theme perfectly cuz yep. ours is all outdoor. We do pump like jack-o-lanterns. Yep. Um corn stalks. Corn stalks. So this guy and how he is there's a little clip on the inside, and it just clips right, right to, to your, your shoulder, yep. to your shirt. Yep. So this is very cool. Do you remember the store we got? Lord this from? Grimley's Manor. Okay. Lord Grimley's Manor, um, which we have some more stuff we'll show you for, uh, for, uh, that we got, but not yet. Yeah. Stay tuned. So, really cool stuff. So um, I think he even had an online website, so you guys could always look him up if you really like these. And they had so many. And if you want to see what else they had, we showed them in detail on the video. That was video part one. one. Part one. one. Part and then, one. of course, we had to a get spider. the right. spider, yep. you know, with the red eyes. And that's another thing. We have several spiders that we have through our haunt and yep. things like that. So these were... Very cool. Had to come home, and they were only twelve bucks. Yep, and they're cool. Like if you've got like people who, like she said, work in the queue line as you interact, they're great. They're great talking pieces. If yeah. you're sitting there, it's just something to entertain people with. So, so what do we got next? The last, like, um, well, I got this bag. This cool bag. That is awesome. The bag actually was free. I got this from Halloween. T-shirt company. T-shirt company. Their stuff was they had amazing. So, so cool. many cool shirts. I went shirt crazy, and I'll tell you what, you guys. Out of all the holidays, because I get shirts and stuff for all the holidays, Halloween, I have more than any. Probably even more than Christmas. And I'm a Christmas crazy girl. But Halloween, I have so many shirts. I got to show you probably, I don't know which one is my favorite. Start with what you got in your hands. But. This is awesome. I absolutely love that. It's Frankie and the Mrs. Right. Sharing, sharing a malt. This is David and I. Yeah. Right here. That's about it. That's us. Yeah. <laughs> except just, except Jamie wouldn't be sharing with me. She'd say, get your own. Maybe. Depends on the flavor. And you got a print on the back too? Uh, no. No, no. Okay. Gotcha. No. Yep. But I just was kind of looking at it to talk about it a little bit. But I just love the hint of pink. I love the color. Um, I'm not really a pastel girl. I'm more dark colors, but 80 I vibes. love it. And, and Definitely 80 just vibes. so you know, oh, it's cool. They have it even printed inside. Yep. I was trying to see if it was like 100% cotton or whatever, but really nice. This is my first time getting their shirt. So we'll, it's 100% uh, cool. You know, I'll kind of let you guys know because if we see them in another one, I probably would buy more of their shirts. Yes. And then there's this oh, one. Oh, that one's awesome. I couldn't pass the retro look up. So they had, I'm not going to lie. So because I already got the other frankie and her i think i should have got the werewolf because the werewolf was so cool yeah like he was absolutely but no awesome. hold open that back up i'm gonna show you a bonus here that people would miss what? uh coming out of the popcorn that's the creature from the black lagoon is his hand you know that's i thought that was really cool oh, that's his hand sure coming is. out of the popcorn so it sure is yeah let me just, see. just a really cool little Easter egg. But their shirts, they had so many. And and not everything they had was kind of artsy retro. Some of it was very vintage. Mm -hmm. Some of it was actually creepy. Yeah. But it was all just really good artwork, really, really cool stuff. Just very cool t-shirts. 
And this one, I gotta say, maybe might be my favorite. And I don't know if you, so it, from afar, it looks like a jack-o'-lantern, right? Wait, there's more. But as you Ooh. get closer. It's witches! It's witches! <laughs> and I love some witches, you guys. I love some witches. <laughs> and there's like ghosts in up here. So I just think it's a really cool it's a cool shirt. Like it's a piece that you can talk about. So I got to say, this is probably my favorite shirt. So that's what I went crazy on and bought. Um, and then you got me. Um, oh yeah. And she, then you got, we had to, because we had such a great time here. Mm -hmm. We definitely needed a memento. Uh, Fear Expo, there's the logo there. Uh, by the way, next year is going to be in April. So if you're not doing anything, make it to this. This is awesome. We're hoping we, we can do this. Going. We're hoping we can do this and Trans World. You know, We're if, hoping. If everything works out, we'd love to be able we to make really it both shows. We really would love to do Trans World, you guys. That is, that's kind of on our, wisp, our list, but I'll tell you what's at the top of our list. Tell me. What's on the top of our list? The top of our list? Yeah. Are you talking about haunts or shows? The top of our list. Haunted Overload? Yeah. Yes. Haunted Overload. That's we, where we really want to go. We were going to try to go this year. We wanted to make the pilgrimage as every Halloween fanatic should make a pilgrimage to Salem, right? So we were going to try to get out there to Salem this year. Um, obviously, some things happened that we had to kind of make some changes on the fly. Uh, but... Uh, Salem is about an hour outside of New Hampshire, which is where Haunted Overload is. And that's that's something that we... You guys have never even heard or seen it. Look on YouTube and check it out. Better yet, just go. So, <laughs> but I'm just saying, like, just to see what we're talking about. Yeah. So cool. They're awesome. Like, I would love to go there. Yes. But yes. we do have some other stuff here for the haul, so we're going to... David's going to tell you the next two right here. So for all the Jamie Loving All Seasons fans, by the way, go check out Jamie Loving All oh. Seasons. Make sure you check out Jamie Loving All Seasons. Did Thanks. I tell you that Jamie Loving All Seasons is an awesome channel? It is. <laughs> but um, for all you Jamie Loving All Seasons fans, this, this is, is where you this guys is where it's, go, <laughs> oh, that's a little creepy for me. <laughs> this is where it gets into the uh, See, very, sure very, the very fun, macabre. Yeah. <laughs> so um, I'll start off... Um, one of the um, one of the uh, vendors up there that we uh, went to check out uh, was um, Monster Misfit, or yes. mis I think it was Monsters Monster Mi Misfit. Monster X Misfit. Misfit. I think I'm saying that right. If I'm saying that wrong, then we're sorry. You know, you know please but do the old. We say a lot of stuff wrong. We so. do. We do. Just we're not comment good. below and let we're us know good. the right one. So, and you know, you can even ask um, Joel from Halfway to Halloween. I have mispronounced. And miscalled his wife's name. By the way, it's oh, Nikki. Yeah. It's Nikki. Nikki. Uh, by the way, if you're I'm, watching, I'm I'm he is very sorry. I'm see now. I'm see now. Very sorry. So, but anyway, uh, Monster Misfits did some really cool stuff, and I quickly saw some things that I'd love to incorporate into this year's little shindig. So we found these cool little uh, crosses here um, that he made. Um, and you can't really see the detail in it. Uh, you'll be able to see it on the next one. And, uh, uh, that, yep, that's a, that's an eyeball. That's an eyeball. That is not a red vine, but, uh, that is an eyeball. But, uh, we thought this guy would be great in the graveyard. He so, will. He and will we, look very cool. Though. And we got two of them. Uh, this was one. And the other one kind of had like a cool stain on it, which I thought was really cool because it made some of the detail pop. And he also had a red vine hanging out of his, his skull. Um, so, but both of those I thought were really cool and I thought, man, Show the back too, kind yeah. Of how it, yeah, so it's like bubbled over yeah. and, and it looks like if I didn't know any better, I'd say he used that expanding foam and then painted it. That's it kind of what it looks cool like, though. but it is very cool. And I was like, yeah, I can do one of those. Uh, so, uh, these are a few that we had, um, I'm going to get out of the way while Jamie talks to you so I can show you some of the other stuff because we're crowded over here. We don't have a lot of room. We're kind of in a tight little tuna can, but I'll be right back. So, you guys, um, kind of some of the things that you want to be on the lookout for, what we're going to be doing here soon is obviously halfway to Halloween. Um, it, we are so excited. We can't wait. May 6th 
It's in Ann Arbor, Michigan at the Wash, no, Washington yeah, Council. Washington Farm Council. Um, they're on Facebook. You can find out all the information. They have so many vendors. So that's like a huge thing that will be coming up. Um, what else? I'm trying to think. I'm not going to lie. We really would like to make a little trip to Columbus, Ohio. We met Carnage. Mia. We, Mia. We met Mia. She runs Carnage. And we missed out this past weekend. She was doing like an Easter, um, like an evil bunny. Like you had to try to find the, the Easter bunny uh, eggs. And I will tell you, if you kind of want to see that though, go check out Halloween Life. They got to do a video. We were going to try to meet up, but it just didn't work out for us. Um, if you want to stand back, do you want to stand over there? You're going to come over. I'm coming over here. Okay. Okay. So I'm going to try not to knock anything okay. over. <laughs> Sorry, is. you guys. Okay. So, this is one of our gifts. Uh, this is our... Well, it's not a gift. He bought it, you guys. <laughs> yeah. There's, there's it was a, a gift. It was a gift. It was a gift. <laughs> now, Slaughterhouse Effects. Yes. Thank you. This is the Wraith costume, which drapes over you. Um, and, I don't think uh, you guys can get like the whole, the whole gist of it. Or you hang it on like a pole or yep. something. Or a dummy. A dummy, yep. which would be great. Yep. And, you know, David loves to throw something. There it is. Well, you know the tradition. We're about to announce a winner. So I've got to announce the winner in grand fashion. But anyway, this is one of the things that we got from Slaughterhouse Effects. Which, big shout out, Slaughterhouse Effects. If you guys don't know them, go check them out. They have amazing creations, right? Yes. And they're in our video you saw. But we've also got one thing coming from them that we had custom made. Yes. Uh, really excited about it. And so. that's what's cool about them, real quick, um, is that they will kind of, if you see a mask but you want something changed a little bit, they don't upcharge you for it. They just do it. Yes. Now, I can't say that's going to be for everything, but I know he told us that on a lot of his masks. Yep, and you'll so, see that in the video. He actually talks about that, but yeah. he does some So awesome check work. out that video if you have it, you guys. Yep, yep. They do great stuff, great work. Um, and um, once again, we, we mentioned Lord Grimley's Manor earlier. Yeah. So we are going to show you some of the other uh, spoils that we got from Lord Grimley's Manor. Uh, this one mass I saw, I couldn't, literally just got me right when we walked I mean, in. we walked in and he immediately was buying Because so. this guy said, buy me. This is pestilence. Um, and I was very, oh no, actually, yeah, famine. It's either famine or pestilence. He'll probably correct me. Uh, yes, it does. But I can't see anything. <laughs> so, but anyway, this is, this is the pestilence mass. So. Yes, it is pestilence. Yes, it is pestilence. So I saw this and I thought, how cool what is, is that? What is pestilence from? Yes. My One of the four horsemen. Okay. So they have a whole collection. They have pestilence, war, famine, and obviously death. Right. Um, so those were good. Just in case someone didn't know. Yep. Know. Yep. So we'll that one. Okay. And then so we've got, got another one to show you also from Lord Grimley's Manor. Uh, David there were went, so many. There were so many. Went crazy. Oh, yeah. The mask. You know, I knew I was going to get in trouble with masks when I got there because. You know, we are doing something cool this year in our hunt, you know, and hopefully it the weather cooperates. Yeah. Uh, but we've got some really cool ideas that we're going to throw out and can't wait to share with you. But we were going to need more masks to pull this off. So this is our other mask. This here is our zombie. And we told you like jack-o'-lanterns, pumpkins, because it was supposed to be like on a farm is our backstory. So... You, I mean, it's it's pretty nice. Yeah, I and mean, they actually it's have. Gross, it, but <laughs> the cool thing is inside, there's actually foam fitters for comfort. You know, so you know these mask makers have gotten so good at really keeping your comfort in mind because you've got to wear this. It's hot, and sometimes Are you can't you hot see. Right now? Actually, I'm I'm pretty good. This thing is breezy, easy breezy cover girl. No. For those who remember that, I just aged myself. Easy breezy, beautiful cover girl. That's me. Um, so, but yeah, but yeah, yeah. So these masks, they're very good. 
there, visit also Lord Grimley's Manor. Check out the math they do. Yes. Um, so uh, that's that. Um, now, winner. We're gonna get into winner the winner. Time. Winner, winner. So guess what, you dinner. guys? Out of that video, we had so. By the way, thank you for all the new subscribers. Yes. Really quick, we want to do, and of course, thank you for all our returning subscribers. Yes. We appreciate you guys. We appreciate the thumbs up. We appreciate the comments, and we love commenting with you. But um, we want to thank you all. And that video had the second. It was the second one, right? Yeah. Second one from Fear Expo. It's the highest video. Highest video we've ever had. Yes. So, and as you guys know, we hit over a thousand subscribers, which is pretty awesome for Thanks this to channel. You guys. We're actually Thanks at like twelve hundred or something over twelve hundred. Yes. So, but we only got two entries. So. Two entries out of all those views. Yes. One of you are going to be a lucky winner. We are going to do heads and tails. I want to show. So let's tell. Let, let, let's, the heads. Let's go into detail. And there's I, the tails. I am team Amanda LeBron. I'm team Amanda LeBron. And you are. Team Bree. Team which Bree. is Which is. What is the name of her channel? Um, the name of her channel is Make Scare Hunt. There we go. See, go check it out. So, Make Scare Team Marie, Hunt. Team, Team Amanda, Marie. and one of you are going to become a winner, and we'll see you there at halfway to Halloween. So, dear lady, which coin are you taking for Team Bree? Bree, what should we do? What should we do? Should it be heads? Amanda, I am going to make a wise decision on your behalf. I say we will be the tail. Okay. So tails for Amanda, heads for uh, Bree. Team Bree, make scare hunt. Okay, how am I going to do this? <laughs> well, it lands where it lands. You know, where it lands, nobody knows. What is that? What is that? What is that? Tails! Tails! Ew. It is tails! Did I not tell you that I was going to make <laughs> the right decision for you? Ray, I'm sorry, but still. Amanda wrong. LeBron. Amanda LeBron. It is tails. You are the winner. I tell you what, Bree, you should come down and hang out with us anyway. Anyway, we would We'll love take to care of you. We'll take care of you. Come on down anyway. We would love to see you there. And you know what? Maybe David and I could do we could buy you a ticket, Bree. There you go. So, Amanda, Amanda, you are the winner. Winner, winner, turkey I'm sorry, dinner. Bree, you don't get all the special things, but we'll buy your ticket to get in. Hey, we're going to have fun. Exactly. We're going to have fun. It's going to be a good time. Yes. It's a little dry, but come on down, and we would love to hang out. Yes. But Amanda, congratulations. congratulations. I'm so happy for you as well. Um, I'm just excited and make sure once you... This is the part where you go, hey, cover girl, tell her what she won. Oh, sorry. Cover girl, what did she win? I'll tell you what you won, Amanda. You won one entry to Halfway to Halloween. And not just one entry, you also won an RIP pass. What is an RIP pass, you may say? An RIP pass gives you entrance to the event. Also... One round of Jelly Ball, and also a ticket into the escape room. The escape room. Yeah. And then, wait, there's more. There is more. You also get some cool swag, halfway to Halloween t-shirt, lanyard. Very cool, very cool. And then, you still have all of the other wonderful, amazing you vendors who will be the there. Vendors. You'll have the Halloween Hall, and you'll also have the maze. So, make sure you reach out I, to I, us. They might, you might even get an escape room. Don't quote us on that. No, the escape room is included. Oh, it is. It is included. So, okay. So. And we did it last year. We sucked. Last, we sucked horribly. So. We won't be doing it. Don't watch that video <laughs> to get any kind of clues on how to get by. It'll only help you fail. Right. Most importantly, Mr. Amanda LeBron, 
what we need you to do is I don't know if you have Instagram. You can reach out to us on Instagram. Yes, yeah, so if you're following us on Instagram at Roxbury underscore Hunter on Instagram. Now, if you don't have Instagram, you can also email us. You can email us at hunt at the roxbury at gmail.com. That's hunt at the roxbury at gmail.com. There it is. So we have our winner. This I'm is so exciting. Happy. Congratulations, Amanda. We're so happy that you won. And I know you're going to be pretty stoked. So. And come see us when you're there. Yeah. We'll have some stickers for you. Make so. sure you say hi. Yep. And we'll have some stickers for you too, Bree. Come down. Come represent the Cleveland Hot Club down here in Michigan. Yep. We want to see you down there. Yep. So, um, we talked about what was coming up. There's more. <laughs> There's always more. Mm -hmm. So, as Jamie said, May 6th, halfway to Halloween in Ann Arbor. And that is going to be at the Washington Farm Council, which, if you've never been here, this is probably one of the coolest venues I've ever seen for, for, for a trade show. It's perfect for Halloween. It is. It, it is. It's a creepy, spooky vibe. Okay. And it, and it is unique, 100%. I promise you, you've never been to a venue that's like this, mm -hmm. and it is very cool. And I think this is going to be one of their biggest years. So I it agree. is very exciting as uh, we get closer to that. So make sure you go. It is. It doesn't cost much to get in. I believe it's five bucks. I think it's five bucks. We're like the worst. Yeah, we we could be wrong. We'll correct that. I, we'll yeah. correct that in the comments if we're wrong, guys. So stay tuned for that. But I believe it's not. It's five bucks, I believe. So you yeah. don't want to miss this. Um, obviously, if you want it's a RIP pass, day. it's a fun day for for your family yeah. to get out. There's there's fun Halloween. There's creepy Halloween. There's spooky Halloween. Um, there's so much. They have food trucks. They have a her show. Yes. By and Dead Sled is sponsoring the her show. So if you've ever heard of Dead Sled, it's a really big um her if, if you've been if you've been a uh I, I believe you, if you've been a Wicked Bazaar, if you've been to halfway to Halloween before, any of the things around Michigan, Dead Sled is involved with that. But I think they're Michigan. I don't know. Yeah. So, Once again, here yeah. we don't know. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> but you don't want to miss this. So, like I said, this is going to be an awesome event. As you said, there's so much surrounding it, so and it'll be really cool. And there's something there for everybody. Yeah. If you're in a really cutesy craft, there's that stuff is there. Mm -hmm. um, there's so much. I'm, I'm not going to overcome it. Right. But more importantly, if you thought that was the end of our Halloween off season, you are completely wrong. Mm -hmm. Because the very next week, the very next weekend. I believe we're talking May 13th, May 12th, May 13th at Deranged. Deranged Hunt. Ooh, that's right. Deranged Hunt is doing the halfway to Halloween. And Deranged is in Romulus, Michigan. They do an awesome hunt. You don't want to miss it. They're doing one for halfway to Halloween. Yeah. And uh, we plan on we plan on attending that and also attending their Halloween event. Yeah. But I am really excited for that too as well. Yeah. So just stay tuned. We're gonna get plenty of your Halloween fix. We're going to deliver. We promise. Yeah. So, have I missed anything? I don't think so because you thought of something that I forgot about. Which I'm excited to see that because Durain is an outdoor haunt. So I think that'll be that'll be, that'll yes. be really fun. Yes. Yes. And they have a very cool setup here. So we're really excited. Matter of fact, if you did watch our video where we were. Uh, Featuring the uh, the first look at the blow up maze that will be That's at Halloween. That's where we were at on the ground. Huh? We were we were at the we were at Durang's hunt. They have a huge chunk of land there where they uh, do this awesome hunt. We're lo really looking forward to it. Said, uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Let's, let's we do YouTube live, especially this one. Oh come on now, come on now. That's what we call them when we say we're going to do something and then we don't do them. Yeah, another turn, YouTube turn into a YouTube live. YouTube. All right. All right, so that's that's everything, guys. Um, once again, we want to thank you guys for helping us Make grow sure this you guys channel. Give us the big thumbs up. It really does help the channel. It helps us grow. Comment below. We'd love to hear what you guys are doing. Are you guys going to any? Um, I was gonna say comment. 
um, are you guys going to anything midsummer screen comment below let us know if you guys are going there we would love to go there we can't hold on once again there's more so obviously we can't make it to california but we have an affiliate who is in california our good friend ignacio lopez will be at midsummer screen right, so we will be bringing you content from our affiliate in los angeles mr ignacio lopez so we will have midsummer screen for you the guys this year so once again she has forgotten but don't worry your beautiful breezy cover girl is here for you my hair is getting um i did wear it so but anyways i think that's it but make sure you guys like i said give us the big thumbs up it really does help this channel and we appreciate each and every one of you we do we love you guys just like our family um this is our haunted family yes um so we love it and we love you guys so and please subscribe so you yeah, can continue you to see the madness that we are you never know what with. we're gonna post i say the same thing on my channel but you truly don't know what we're gonna post it could be a, a haul it could be a walkthrough it could be um an expo like we just did i mean there's so much it could be david or i doing something making something you know, even if it's a short, something for Halloween, you never know what we're going to post. But we are going to say goodbye because we're really long-winded and we've, we've, you know, gone way too far. Besides, we have tacos upstairs and I want more tacos. Thank you guys, really. Bye, guys. We sincerely appreciate you. Until next time, we will see you soon and keep it creepy.